what is up welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome and if you're returning thank you so so much for coming back and joining me in another video so in today's video as you can see by the title of this video i am going to sephora i'm going shopping it is there during their sale time but by the time that probably by the time you see this video it'll probably be past the sale time but i figured if you're anything like me where we shop at Sephora all year round so like why not show what I got there are some things that I need to pick up I need to re-up on but then there's also some things that I'm looking to try that will be new to me so yeah let's just go ahead and head inside and see what we can find We're back and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got so I would say that that was a pretty successful Sephora shopping experience um, the people in there were really nice they really helped me out a ton there was a couple of things that I wanted to pick up that they did not have so I am gonna have to order those online but one of those things I will be at least able to pick it up probably tomorrow um, she said that I can just order it online and do like in-store pickup instead of like shipping it to me so hopefully I'll get that soon and I'll let you know what that is of course once I go through everything but yeah I have my bag right here my big bag well it's not that big kind of a medium size but she had to double line it because I got a lot of stuff so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that I got in no particular order at all okay so the first thing that I got is this Brazilian crush cherry cherry rosa I don't know if I'm saying that right child but everybody knows what this is this is number 68 i think it was number 40 the darker pink one that's the one i really wanted honestly i like both of them i like this one and i like the darker pink one but i feel like i like that one just a little bit better but they didn't have that in the smaller bottle they only had it in the bigger bottle which i would have done but i really like the smaller bottles because i can travel with them and i don't know they're just like the big ones are just too big and bulky so i just got this one for now and i figured whenever either it comes back in stock or honestly i might see if they have this in stock online as well to pick up and i'll just i'll have both of them because i do like this one but i just like that one just a, a tad bit more all right so the next couple of things that i picked up i did get the or i do already have some of the necessaire body wash the eucalyptus one at home and so i didn't need to re-up on that just yet but i've been seeing a lot of people talk about the body serum so i've been wanting to get my hands on this it is fragrance free so if you have like sensitive skin it should be fine I have sensitive skin and I've been using the um, body wash for a while now and it hasn't like irritated me or anything so I'm really excited to try the serum as well and then while I was in there actually like I said the workers in there were really really helpful but the lady the girl in there that's my sis low-key because she put me on I'm excited to try this she said that she also has like sensitive skin she has eczema and she really really likes this body cream it is the necessaire body cream also fragrance free so I'm excited to try this to see how I like it I like that it's fragrance free because I can mix it with any perfume and so I'm excited to try it it's really thick she like kind of tried it on for me not tried it on but like kind of rubbed a little bit in her hand and it looks really like thick and moisturizing so We'll see how I like this. So the next thing that I picked up are a few products from Way. I did get one of their fragrances. This one is the Melrose Place. I couldn't remember honestly if the one that I like was Melrose Place or Dean Street or maybe it's both of them. I honestly cannot remember. So I did smell this in store and I did like it. So hopefully this is the one that I have. I have some at home but there's like 
the smallest amount left so I just wanted to re-up and get some more because I do really like it this is a nice scent for like the spring summertime I feel like it's a nice clean fresh just like not airy but I guess airy kind of scent so yeah I would definitely recommend smelling this in store they do have a ton of other scents but this is the only one they had in store so I don't know what's up with that but I do like this one so that's a plus for me so the other two whey products that I picked up was the body cream and the body scalp and body scrub but I plan on just using it for my body in the St. Bart's scent I did also want the body wash for this but they are out of stock in store so that's one of the products that I'm gonna see if I can maybe place a pickup order for and hopefully pick it up tomorrow but I do want to try the body wash as well I've been seeing this like all over the place and I really do like the scent it's a nice like summery scent I guess you can kind of say like it's I don't know it smells really good I don't know if there is a description or not there's not really a description I feel like you just kind of have to smell it but it smells really good I would recommend it and I'm excited to try it hopefully mm, it smells so good hopefully it is nice and like moisturizing I'm not too worried about like the body wash or the scrub but like for the body cream Hopefully it's moisturizing. We will see. The next thing that I picked up, which I've also been seeing all over the place, is a Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. I ended up going with this color. They didn't have the, um, like the brown one, brownish color one is the one I've been seeing all over. But they did not have that in store in stock. So I actually tried this on. This is the cherry one. And I actually have it on right now. It's kind of like faded out just a little bit. It is a little bit brighter than this when you put it on but it's not like super bold so I didn't want it to be like super like red bold because that's not really like an everyday color but it's not super bold like I said when I first put it on it was a little bit brighter than this but it's definitely kind of calmed down some so I picked it up I really like how it feels on the lip so I'm excited about this for sure I usually get the Laneige um lip balms and the sleeping mask but i have some at home i do not need any more of those because literally every time i come i stock up on like a few of those of the lip balms so i'm good on those for a while but i definitely wanted to try something new and because i've been hearing about all the hype about this I figured I would give it a try so the next couple of things that I got is actually from the belief line these are OG products for me I just needed to re-up on them but I got the true moisturizing balm the true cream moisturizing balm basically it's like their like daily moisturizer and I really love this moisturizer I've actually been out for a while now and so I this is one of the things that I've just been waiting to come to pick up but it's really really nice it's really really moisturizing and also for like I said my sensitive skin my eczema it works really really well also the eye cream the moisturizing eye balm same thing very moisturizing around my eyes like very hydrating and absolutely love this stuff would recommend it a thousand times so the next thing that I picked up is from the Sephora collection and once again this is another oldie but goodie i've been using these for literally years these are the glow peel pads these are unscented and they're very um i feel like they're very good for just like a light cleanse if that makes sense so sometimes i'll use these like after i wash my face or sometimes i'll use these like in the morning when i wake up so like usually i'll wash my face at night and then in the morning i'll kind of just like rinse my face off um i don't use a cleanser twice a day because that's just too irritating for my skin but i'll go in with something like this rinse my face off and go in with something like this just to kind of help cleanse it I guess like a light cleanse it also is really good for a very light exfoliation as well so I really like these I feel like they kind of take the place of like your toner and a cotton pad instead these are like little cotton rounds and they're already like moist so I really like them I feel like I get a lot of use out of them so ended up or went ahead and re-upped on this as well so the next thing that I picked up is actually a makeup product I only got one surprisingly makeup product I guess not that surprising because I'm not like super into makeup anyways I kind of just stick to what I know but I ended up picking up this Charlotte Tilbury 
airbrush flawless finish powder and I've been hearing a lot about this as well I am planning on using this just to kind of set not really set my makeup but just as an overall like all over face powder and I got it in the color medium so I'm hoping that that is the right color for me I feel like it might be more of my winter color but we'll see like I said I don't really plan on using it as like a foundation necessarily but just like when I just want to do a little something you know just a little something like I said I'm not like a super makeup girly but I like to do a little something on the occasion last thing that I picked up was just one of these touch touch land little hand sanitizers this is the wild watermelon scent and honestly I just got this because it was cute it said hydrating it said hand sanitizer and it was cute so i picked it up so yeah y'all that is everything that i picked up from the sephora sale i will be going back and getting the body wash possibly the little body spray the brazilian one um possibly getting the number 40 which is like the darker pink color and then i'm also gonna wait until they have it back in stock or i may check on the website i really want to try the k ali i think it's like their pistachio scent as soon as i can get my hands on that i'm gonna look online and if not maybe on their website but i will be purchasing that as well i smelled it in store and it smells phenomenal but yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys very, very soon in my next video. Bye, y'all.